to see our gemstone enhancement chart. All right, welcome back, everybody. I'm just getting organized here. We've got a great show. I have items, uh, some items that I've never presented before that I am so excited about uh, for you in this show. Um, as you know, I, you know, I was a big kitchen guy. I worked in the restaurant business for about 18 years or so. I don't even remember anymore, but it was a long time. And I know really good quality stuff when it comes to kitchen and storage. Um, so I got a couple items that are going to be coming up a little bit later. The first one uh, I just think is amazing. It comes to us from a company called Dash. And I love, love, love Dash. This is the smallest electric cook pot I've seen, but I love the size of it. It's the eight inch mini electric skillet. Look at this. It's a perfect size for like two people or for a great side dish. You know, sometimes you don't want to take out your skillet and cook 13 hamburgers. You just want to cook a little mini meatloaf or a mini pizza. It comes with the lid. It's adjustable thermostat control. Hold that, Brett. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> I was getting in my way. Look at that. It's ideal. And you could take this with you. I mean, church suppers, whatever, side dishes, Swedish meatballs, $22. I'm buying that. That I am buying today. And also, uh, and these are the folks that created it. You know, about 30 years ago, a company called Food Saver came up with an idea uh, from, a, from, a, from basically from science where they said, you know, if we could remove the air, because air is what really spoils everything. It ripens things, and it also brings them to their demise at the end because things rot. If you can remove the air from whatever it is that you are uh, um, storing, it will make it last longer. Not only do you get the Food Saver vacuum, but you get the containers and the bags to go along with it. $39.99, I mean, this is brilliant. And then to release the air, you hit the button. Uh, those are microwave safe containers. I love it, that's coming up later. Normally a food saver, you're gonna spend, what, 150 bucks for one of those. This is the compact home version. It's only $39.99. All right, I'm going over here. All right, let's go this way. Come on over, everybody. Welcome into our big, giant kitchen. Uh, my name is Guy, by the way, if I didn't say that. Uh, I got another hour with you, and we are coming out of the gate with something super smart. In our last show, we showed you the little portable uh, recyclable bag holder, which is brilliant, and I promised you we were gonna get you some bags. Not just any bags. These bags have taken the world by storm. Uh, here at HSM, people are loving them. Why? They are the best travel, grocery, lunch, food bags I have ever seen. They have built-in insulation to keep everything nice and cold, to keep everything warm, depending on what you put in there. So if you're bringing a chicken out of the rotisserie from the store, or you're bringing milk and ice cream, they are perfect. The best beach bag ever. You know, they don't let you bring coolers to the beach here on a lot of beaches in Florida. They don't care if you bring a bag. Bring what you want. The price is the lowest we've ever aired a three pack of these bags here at HSN. We have several colors, I'm gonna to get to those in a bit, but $17.95 for three bags, not one. Three bags is a deal of the day. Um, as I said, lowest price ever. Laura Baker, come on out here with your cool Hi. little plaid bag. This is so easy, comfy. They're lightweight. They're cute too, aren't they? They're so, they are, they're so well made. Uh, when, they you really grab, are. when you get them home, you're gonna be like, these aren't the ones that, that that I get for like, you know, a few bucks at the store. That's These exactly are right. really, These are really nice. industrial. The capacity is huge. All three, only $17.95. And look at how much Miss Laura has inside. Them. I mean, these really are quite massive. They hold a lot of stuff. So if you're running to the grocery store and you have all your fruits and vegetables and cheeses and meats, and then you realize, oh, I still need to pick up my child or my grandchild from school. Maybe you have to stop at the post office, but you don't want all your, your vegetables and fruits to go bad. Well, thanks to the insulation inside of here, you can easily make a few stops on the way home and be able to keep all of your groceries nice and cool. By the way, this insulation is good for cold. It's also good for hot foods, and it replaces all of this. If you're doing this in the grocery store, I've had so many holes in these, first of all. Almost every single time I get home, there's holes in the bottom of them. I've actually had a jar of pasta drop right oh, out of yeah. the bottom of the one, and, the, and that was a mess. And, yeah, and if something breaks I mean, inside there, you, you can just wash clean it out. These, right? Yeah, you absolutely just yeah. wash it out. And now, if you live in a lot of cities or in a lot of states in America, they're charging you for plastic bags. Even the largest 
kids theme park no longer does that plastic bags and if you they buy any toys there or yeah. any other stores you know you still have to they're doing right yeah they're doing regular re uh, recyclable bags re that you can you know purchase. that you can reuse for purchase. Yeah. and they have paper straws in there as well you can't get plastic anywhere in the park so this is really the way to go and and what i love about it lord too is that we we did them in these fun fashion colors um if you wouldn't mind why don't we go through some colors okay we can definitely then, go through some and colors then we'll and then we'll come the, back to how much you how can much hold you can and how sturdy in. they are that okay. sounds good the colors are all over there so we're going to make it real easy for yeah. you because Maybe it's a I'll lot easier over. to look at them all yeah. at one time come so on, you can come with me we'll okay. take a walk together <laughs> So remember, you're going to get three. They do come gift box, by the way. They so do. if you want to give these to somebody, or if you're looking to stock up for, uh, you know, maybe Secret Santa things down the road, they come box. So. Everybody gets three. They do. So this is the classic prints. Okay, so the classic prints includes the hound's tooth, the polka dot, and the plaid. And notice each one comes with its matching gift box. So it truly look. is bow and go. Look. And it's something that Boxes everybody, match. everybody in your life is going to be able to use these bags, Love guys it. and girls. So then we have the basic colors. Okay, so the basic is the red, the blue, and the black. Remember, you're not picking, you're getting all three. All three. three. Yeah. All three. This is our second airing of the day today. This was most popular earlier today. This is the floral. So the floral comes with the roses, the sunflowers, and the black and white daisies. Very, very sweet. And then, of course, here we have the multi. The multi has the aqua, the pink, and the gray. This is a nice one if you want to keep the aqua and the pink for yourself, but you want something neutral for your husband to maybe take to lunch and work, sure. he can yeah. take that gray, too. And that's really what it's all about. It's about having bags that are insulated so you can take them wherever you go, and you don't have to worry. I mean, initially, we thought of them as, all right, Grocery bags, mm -hmm. right? We have great grocery bags because they have the insulation inside. And then all of a sudden we started thinking, you know, if you went on a picnic and you needed to bring something cold and you went, maybe you had some wine or champagne or whatever in or there. football season that football starts on season, Saturday, yeah. right? I know, absolutely. So this is a way to be able to really take those things with you. And oftentimes what happens to us here is we actually have things that are, you know, like if you take a cooler, it's heavy, it's right. bulky, it's not easy to throw over your shoulder. And even some of the newer ones that are out there that are soft-sided, I have one that costs almost $100 and it's heavy before I even put the food in. So I have it, it was gifted to me and I ended up re-gifting it, giving it to someone else because by the time I stacked it up to take actually to a tailgate for a football game, it was so heavy I couldn't carry it from my parking spot over to where I was meeting my friends. With this though, you still get that wow. capacity and it's still holding things. So see all these cans up here up front? This is 35 soda cans. Now, maybe you don't drink soda. It could be water. It could be, you know, the sports drinks. It could just be your food. But I want you to see those same amount of cans are all inside of this bag because it holds so much. Yet, notice how these straps aren't breaking. It's not falling apart. It's 17 inches long by 10 inches by 4 inches wide with a 21-inch strap drop. So you easily can fit this over your shoulder comfortably, even if you're wearing a winter coat in the middle of January. I think they're brilliant. And, and they're going to really come in handy when you, like we said, when you're making trips. Keep a couple in the car. Um, I mean, at this price, you could probably afford to get a couple of sets. Um, but think about, you know, the grocery chips, or, or maybe it's just your kid's lunch, or your husband's lunch, or your your wife's stuff. I mean, whatever it is, the, even a gym bag. I mean, just because it's insulated doesn't mean you can't put sneakers and a towel and whatever else you want to put inside there. What's mm -hmm. nice is when you do it's put true. food in there, you have that extra uh, feature of having it uh, stay at temperature. They're also completely leak-proof, air, uh, watertight, so you don't have to worry about that. We'll show you that in a moment, too. But whether you're going on a road trip, I mean, here in Florida, we, we these things are priceless, especially for the beach, to keep things nice and cold. And as I said before, at the, a lot of the beaches here don't allow you to bring coolers because they think, you know, if he's got a cooler, it's probably full yes. of beers or whatever. You can put whatever you want in there, and it just looks like and a, it just looks really like a regular stylish. bag. It's, it's really cute. Bag. Yeah, they're really fun. They're really cute. And with this one, too, if you want to do hot and cold, the front pocket up front keeps some of those things that don't necessarily need to be refrigerated for just a day trip for lunch. But then on the inside, because of the inside, you can take your hot food from home and take it into lunch and take it into work and you really are able to be able to take all of that with you and then just put it have it at work when you need to and not have to worry about trying to find you know a microwave to heat things up in. 
So we talked about how compact they are and how flat they are. Notice how easily this folds up for yeah. you when, you're, when it's not in use. All you have to do is just simply unsnap it. And then you can see here, it has those nice handles and it has a zipper I love that the rose, goes, this rose oh, isn't this beautiful? It's <laughs> great. The zipper goes all the way across. So it completely unlocks anything. So everything that's in there, as long as it's zip closed, if it, you know, you hit the brakes a little too hard and it tumbles over in the car, stays inside. But I want you to see what else stays inside. I'm taking a bottle of water. Now imagine this being your ice cubes that are melting. Now I like to use ice packs, but sometimes they're not always available. Ice cubes can be more convenient, especially when you're traveling. And this water stays inside. Notice there's nothing dripping here. It's all dry across the bottom and everything is staying in there. So you know that even if the condensation from your food is all gonna stay in place. Look at you. I like to model, I like to model <laughs> things from time to time. Look at it. You saw me walking down, you'd be like, that guy's cool. I mean, look at him. He's got that houndstooth looking bag. Look at that. By the way, there's a little pocket in there. So if it rains, I'm good to go there. This is really comfortable on my arm, by the way. And you, but I will tell you, there's at least 30 pounds of stuff in here. There's a lot of this stuff. Yeah, you picked up a good one. Yeah, it's really, really <laughs> heavy. And I'll show you what's inside it when we come over here, even though I'm going out of order for poor Miss Laura. It's but okay. She, she's used to working with me. So I, she I knows. I put that one there for you. She knows I'm all over the place a little bit. But, <laughs> but there is so much chicken stuff. Look at all, look at all the stuff that's inside here. I mean, you've got, <laughs> there's canned goods. <laughs> it just goes on and on. I can't I believe mean, this. I mean, it really does go on and on and on. in that. So that's another like grocery shopping trip. But you know, we talked about the beach. We talked about tailgating. Jeez, we Lord. talked about travel. <laughs> so it does have that front pocket to store things like your yeah. Better Brella because this is the same company as your Better Brella company. You're gonna unpack that one. I'm going to unpack this one. Which, who's do you think is more fun? Umbrella. I bet I, your mind's more I got, fun. Look what I need. I have here. I got, I got everything I need to go camping. I got There's salad dress. I got cheese and rice and <laughs> pastas and coffees and all that. Look at it. What You're do you right got in here? You're right next to the camping bag. Oh so you said this is the food for camping and these are yeah. your supplies for camping. So I like you it. said, you don't always have to use them. You can just use them sometimes hey, just for fun. Hey, lowest price ever done? ever in the history of this product. It's $7 off. It's only $8.98 to get it home on, on FlexPay. So grab a bunch of these. And you know what, not only that, you're saving the planet. One plastic bag at a time, We right? absolutely are. So we created, this one as a little picnic. Nice. So now I think that this one would be perfect, not just for the picnic. Maybe you're, you know, trying to relive some of your favorite Italian memories, but it's also really, really nice for those tailgates or for Thanksgiving when you need to take some food over to your sibling's house or your parent's house or you're traveling to go visit some people. The other thing that I think is great for this, and I've used these types of bags a lot, is I actually take them and I put them in my suitcase when I travel. Okay, and I'm going to Italy in a month and I'm actually doing that. So I'm taking one, I'm taking it flat when I travel because while I'm there, I know that I'm gonna pick up some wine and cheese or something in the grocery store and sort of enjoy it sitting on the porch of where I'm staying. But then when I come home, so I have it to keep everything cool while I'm there. And by the way, if you're traveling, most countries also charge for bags if you go to the grocery store for anything. And then it ends up being my souvenir bag and that extra carry-on on the way home. Hey, so it, it has is. double duty for And you. remember, they fold up to nothing. I mean, that's really the big deal. So you've got bags. I think a lot of people don't want to bring the recycle bags because they just fold in half and they're, they're kind of clumsy. These roll up and then they have the hook and loop so they close up like a little sleeping bag and you can take them and store them and keep them just in case. You know what I like too? If you have somebody come over and maybe you've got leftovers. You can send it give home them the with bag. them. Yes, especially. What a nice little gift for Five, them six too. Bucks, nice little gift to give to it somebody. Is. All right, pick the <laughs> color that you like, and remember, it's only $8.98 to get these shipped out to your house. 637-402. Thank you, Laura. Thank you. Great job. Thanks for all my stuff. <laughs> all my kids. Well, all you're my good stuff. in the kitchen, yeah. so we'll, we'll let you go to work I with all it. that. All right, let me tell you something that I absolutely love. There it is. Can I walk back there a little bit with you guys? All right, so uh, this is called Tada. Uh, it's actually Tada I4 is what it is. It's the over the sink roll up mat. I bought one of these about a month ago. It's one of my favorite things I bought at HSN. This is actually a stainless steel mat. And I mean stainless steel mat. And then they put silicone on the outside. You know what I use mine for? It's my, it's my drying rack for my dishes. I love this thing. But you can put it over the sink because it's strong enough that it stays over the sink and you can wash your veggies and your lettuce and stuff. It is amazing. Chris Kahatsu is gonna be out here a little bit later. And, the, and I love the fact that the whole thing just rolls up. So if you wanna store it, it just rolls up like that. You know, and if somebody gives you a hard time, now don't do that, but it really is great and I love them. And we have great colors coming up a little bit later. Um, so that's coming up. 
Next, we're gonna talk about what I think is the best portable lunchbox on the market today. And whether you're a big kid, little kid, young kid, old kid, if you take lunch or food somewhere, you need Bentgo. Based on the, uh, you know, the Japanese bento boxes, so everything has a place, everything knows where it's going, yet these are industrial strength on the outside and guaranteed not to drip or leak or do any of that stuff. And when you lock that lid, it seals in everything. The freshness, the flavor, the aromas, everything stays inside. So if you bring a tuna sandwich in the car, in your carpool, nobody's gonna be like, who's eating tuna today? Because it's all safe <laughs> inside, right? Yes, it Amy is. Amy Garden's <laughs> here, everybody. I'm so excited. You brought a two pack of these out yep, uh, about a week or so ago. About a week ago. And people loved them. But we thought, you know what? We want people to try this. Yes. So we, we and I'm telling you, once you try it, you're gonna, be, you're gonna be totally committed to this. I love the design. I love, I really love the, the shape of it mm -hmm. because most lunch boxes or bags right big, bulky, they right. don't really hold stuff. This is brilliant. Well, what I love about, what I love about Bentco, now we do have, uh, this is featured, it's called the Kids Bentco, but really, let's be honest, we talked earlier. It's not This like is good for anybody, anyone. Yeah. I take my lunch to work every day. I think day. they call it kids because it's yeah. colors, but everybody it's likes colors. colors. But <clears throat> it is perfectly portioned. You've got five compartments here. It is perfectly portioned for any child's, you know, eating habits. Um, but what is so great about this is it, one, it's so durable. Right. You've got the perfect portions. So I've got my sandwich, Dipper. Everybody loves to dip, especially yeah. kids love to dip. My ranch dressing, um, you know, my blueberries, my yeah. pretzels, my veggies. And then I'm going to put my lid on. I'm going to snap it shut. It's so easy. You hear that snap shut. And then this goes anywhere with you. Your food is going to stay intact. Your sandwich is not going to get smushed. Your right. sandwich is not going to soggy. You know, it goes in your kid's backpack. They go to school. You know, kids are so careful with things these Watch days. This. <laughs> I just, this is so smart. And then yeah, you because just, the kid's not going to be oh, real yeah. fan. Like, they're going to look it. Nothing moved. Nothing moved inside. So if you're a brown bagger, you like to brown bag your lunch, or you take a ton of, you know, plastic ware, yeah. you know, containers, this, everything goes in one. So it all fits in one. Your food stays safe. Nothing touches. You know, we're picky. Kids are picky eaters. They don't want anything to touch each other. Adults are picky eaters, yeah. and we don't want things to touch, but this keeps everything safe. And then your Watch. tray on the inside the comes, comes right out. out. This is microwavable. <sighs> and dishwasher safe. So the bottom part, I call this the lunchbox part. You wanna hand wash this, but it's very easy to wash. But the inside tray is microwave and dishwasher safe. You know, this would be perfect for my mom and her husband, John. Mm -hmm. um, we have uh, people that help them every day. They're in their 80s, so they have a, they make their they make their meals for them before they right. leave. And I'm like, this would be great for them for their meals so that they can take them. And my mom, you know, has a, has a little uh, issue with some tremors, so mm -hmm. she needs the food to be right there in a tray in front of her. This would be perfect for that. And, you know, also, if you, maybe you're, you're, you're dieting and you want to have portion control, then you're not going to be stuffing yourself full of things like that. You know, you can always bring stuff on the side, but it's the a perfect amount for somebody that maybe is trying to, you know, try, trying to lose weight and trying to do that as well. And they go anywhere. They're virtually indestructible. Yes. Because a regular lunchbox is, so is thin and, and tinny and, and it's bulky. This is perfect. Look at that. Yeah, you can my load little, up my on little those snack. Little things. And what it too, if you have dietary needs, you know, obviously it's back to school time. These are the hottest on the market. If you look at any other store, any other online and shopping, we have the best price too. Hottest on the market, but you will pay twenty seven ninety nine and up for one of these. You're getting these for nineteen ninety nine today, and they are selling out everywhere. So this is the only place that you're going to get this amazing I, I, price. I hope you can understand, and and you will, because you're, you're looking and you're going, well, twenty dollars, and I'm like, no. When you get this home and you feel how heavy duty this stuff mm -hmm. is, it's virtually indestructible. I mean, you could throw this off a five-story building, nothing's right. gonna happen to this stuff. And you've got these great rubber edges, yeah. so especially with kids or anyone who is not as careful and is gonna drop it, it's gonna be indestructible and it's gonna keep everything safe. But I have to show you, so Perfect. this is my favorite, cottage cheese. You think cottage cheese is gonna get everywhere? I've got my chocolate candies, my peanut butter, so watch Lid what goes happens. On. We're going to shake and it. And it's easy. My five-year-old nephews did this easily. They love yeah. packing their own lunches. Anybody can do this. T takes a tumble, falls in the car, in the backpack, in your work bag. Like, I throw mine in my bag to go to work. Open it up. 
<laughs> and everything is perfectly so awesome. in place, has not well, moved. Everything on top, if you look at the top, everything has a uh, has a uh, rubberized gasket, mm -hmm. silicone gasket that, that goes to inside the container to seal each container off. Each individual container. So if you have dressings or if you have right. fruit that has some liquid in there. Pasta, salad. Yes. Nothing is going to mix with each other. $20 for this. Can All I, right. We, can we do colors? Oh, yeah. Let's talk All about right. some colors. All right. So... Since it's not written on my card well, what the colors are, I'm going to let you do it. This is citrus yellow. So we've got our citrus yellow right here on top. And then we have purple next to it. Down on the bottom, we've got blue and then fuchsia. So citrus yellow, purple, so blue fuchsia. They're Let's show everybody some examples of what you did or what you're doing. So again, so this is the bento compartment. You've got five Five compartments, they're all perfectly sized, really for anybody, portion control, dietary needs. You just don't want your food to touch. You don't want to brown bag it because your sandwich keeps getting smushed. And then you can put anything in here. It comes, the tray comes out easily. This is microwavable and dishwasher safe. So you can put that in your microwave if you heat up. I've got some mac and cheese here that I'm gonna put on the inside. Mm -hmm. And Again, that could be gooey. This could be gooey. Yep, nothing is gonna touch. I've got my, you know, chicken nuggets, my dinosaurs over here. Maybe your grandkids too, you know, when you think about yep. them, maybe you've, you're, you're taking care of them and you have to put together lunches for them. Or again, maybe you're a senior and you want to have, uh, you know, you, you're helping out your partner and you mm -hmm. want to put some food together while you while you head out for the day. Look at how everything goes in its in specific spot. Even the little caramel sauce for Even your I've apples. got caramel for my little dessert. But this is great for breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, road trips, any sort of outings that you're going on. So I've loaded my compartment. I'm gonna easily, and anyone can open this, close this, shut the lid, snap, you hear the snap shut. Love it. Throw it in your bag. This can go anywhere. Your car takes a tumble. Open it back up and nothing has moved. It's Mine. all safe. See, I did the same thing. I did it with you. I love it. And <laughs> I have to show you this one because I think this one's great. Okay. So I've got syrup in here. Um, we talked about the word syrup. That's right. <laughs> uh, we Which got is my, the right French, way to say it. French toast syrup, sticks not syrup. and our syrup. <laughs> and what's great is, watch this. I'm going to shut this, give it a nice flip, turn to the side, car, yeah. open it back up. Oh. And that syrup is still in place. Yeah, Yogurt it, is still in place. The held it in there. And you can take the tray right out. Microwave. And what love I love, it. I have to say this about Benko, yeah. they're huge supporters of Feed the Children, so you know that your purchase is going to go to a great cause. A great cause, great and cause. they are feeding the children, large and small, because you're yes. going to love this as well. Amy, great job as always. Thank you, guys. I love this. It's only $19.99 flex pay, only $10 to get at home if you'd like it. Hey, we got a lot of people that are already buying the uh, Dash uh, Mini Skillet. Uh, I will tell you, this thing is brilliant. Come on over, let me show it to you again. So what you've got is you've got an 8-inch mini cooker here and it's it says skillet but i would use this for so many dang things it's perfect size sometimes you don't need a skillet that big and and, and you don't want a little dinky one you want one that's the perfect size you can do a couple of burgers in here you could do some hot dogs in here you could do a side dish for thanksgiving uh it's only 22.95 i think this may sell out today because i i just think i don't have one this size i have a great big one but i rarely use it until unless people are over this is perfect for you comes with a lid and it's adjustable thermostat control as well that's coming up a little bit later. Come on over. Hey, Chris Kahatsu. Hi, guy. You How know, you doing? I, you know, I bought this last time I you were here. I know you did. And you bought I, a couple I, of these. I thought actually. about. I thought about uh, taking a picture of it, and then I was like, well, it's too late because it'd be too hard to get online. But I am telling you. This thing is brilliant. I use it right now mainly is my dish rack. Oh, believe because it. Because I have it, I have it like to the right of the sink and it just, it's perfect. I have a little towel under it and it just, everything drains. It never gets funky or weird. Oh, of course not. I, and then I can bring it over to the sink and I can use it to wash dishes over and I can use it there to wash lettuce and things like that. It's also a trivet. It has yes. so many different uses. Um, I got mine in this color. I got the, uh, the magenta. The magenta. That's the one I have. It I also love comes it. in this great green. It comes in gray, and then it comes in. What's the white one called? That one. That's called? a light gray, light and then gray. we have a dark gray. And a dark gray. Brilliant, good to see I you. I love it. Uh, good to see you too, yeah. guys. So just like you were saying, this is one of those things that has so many uses for it. But the primary one is to replace that nasty dish towel most yeah. of us know that lives on the counter where we put all of our dishes it also replaces those big bulky 
dish racks that just, you know, you can't yes. clean them, you can't put them anywhere. So let me show you how this works. This is actually stainless steel rods, stainless steel reinforced rods that's encapsulated by silicone. And silicone, of course, is that wonderful material we love in the kitchen. And the way this works is you will wash and rinse your dishes in the sink like normal, but then instead of placing them on top of the counter, on top yeah. of that dirty dish rag or that big bulky rack, you'll place this mat right on top of the sink just Watch like this. this and then look i've got a cast iron pan here no problem it'll just dry right over the sink there's stainless Talk about steel this. rods in that's there, right? why it's so yeah. strong i mean i can go ahead and put this whole bowl on here wow. and we don't have to worry about a thing this is a space saver this is actually a cleaner way to do it because you can put this mat in your dishwasher to keep yeah. it clean, right? And then when we talk about additional uses, what we also found is because of the construction of this mat, this mat works great as a colander for all of your yeah. fruits and vegetables. So you can rinse your fruit and vegetables right over your sink. You don't have to get out a strainer. You don't have to put this on the counter where the water goes everywhere. But look at this, What are one, if you have a sprayer, what a wonderful way yeah. to take care of your fruits and, and vegetables. And keep everything nice and fresh. It does so many different duties. It is $19.95, and I'm telling you, I got mine home. What impressed me about it is the weight of it. It's, I mean, don't be, it's, it's heavy duty. It is, it's got steel rods inside, so it, even though it's soft to the touch and it's easy on your dishes, it's amazingly strong, which was the first thing I noticed. Now, we talk about lots of different uses. Because you've got that silicone technology, you can cook on this. Yes. I mean, literally, you, you, you can use this as an oven rack and you can you can cook on this thing. Yes, I'm yeah. so glad you brought that up. So these are actually heat resistant up to 475 degrees. So we've got a really hot pan here. And as we know, kitchen counter space, table space in the kitchen is so important. Look at this, you can use this mat as a trivet, all right? This is a super hot pan and we are putting it right over here. We are protecting the oh, table. It's hot. We're pro yes, it is. Look at that bubbling up. And again, this pan is on this mat, which is protecting this table. It'll protect your countertops. It'll protect your uh, table. If for the holidays are coming up, you can place your baked goods on this. You should could we, even. Should we reveal and show that it oh, hasn't, hurt, hasn't do. hurt anything? Hasn't hurt anything. I mean, you could actually line a table <laughs> with these place your tablecloth on top of it. There it is. See, the table's perfectly fine. I love it. I mean, for the holidays, you could put a couple of these down, line your entire table, oh put a tablecloth on top. It's so great. You, let me tell you this, you could put this on your lap and use it as a tray. Yes. If you wanted to eat off it, you could do that as well. It's, it is absolutely brilliant. We get people that actually will put these on top of their wooden table when they're using yes. their computer. Yes. Because it won't scratch your computer and it won't scratch, the computer won't scratch the table. And it won't move, right? right. So these are very sturdy. Look God. at this, look at my, I, these won't go anywhere. So if you wanted to put a cutting board or like you said, the computer, it. it's not gonna go anywhere because silicone will stay put. Now, because of the way this mat is constructed, look at this, this is the morning time. We make breakfast meats, we make bacon. This mat, when placed on top of just a regular baking Tray, sheet, yeah becomes a roasting rack. So all you have to do is turn on your oven and let's say you wanted to make bacon, you would place this mat on top of a regular baking sheet and when you place your meats in the oven and you cook them, look what happens. All of that fat and grease so drains smart. out into yeah. the pan, not onto your food. And again, cleanup is so easy because yeah. it's dishwasher safe. By the way, that's oven safe to 450 degrees because remember, stainless steel on the inside and heat resistant silicone on the outside as well. So if you wanna use this uh, tabletop, if you wanna use this in the oven, Look, where Chris, look, Chris has actually put it in the oven. I have put it in the oven. So because this is heat resistant, so high, one of the best things that you can do is actually line your oven racks with this mat. So if you're making, like in this case, we have a macaroni and cheese casserole. If the cheese were to bubble over, you're protecting your oven. You're not making a mess on your hands. Maybe pasta dishes, any kind of sauces that pull over. But look at this. Remember what I said about it serving as a sturdy, uh, roasting rack. I've got an entire chicken 
again, using the mat on top of a regular baking sheet, and look at this, I've created a roasting rack out of this mat. Look at you, I, I, you know, I thought when you were doing the bacon and the sausage, I'm like, I would put a bird on there, I'd put a chicken on there, or exactly. a roast on there. And listen, you know, you don't even have to think about just the big dishes, what about the holidays? When we make pies, again, sometimes the fruit boils over and right. you have a mess, place this mat on top of a baking sheet, and let the, if the fruits do boil over, yeah. again, you, you don't clean worry. up as a breeze. Yep. Uh, we use it here as a trivet, so if you're taking hot pots out of the oven or whether it's a boiling pot off the stove uh, and you're making tea or whatever else it is, you know, this, we've got this thing and it's obviously it's piping hot. As you can see, it's a wonderful way, out. kind of like you were saying, to use it as a tray, yeah. right? So if you have guests coming over, say for um, a weekend or for the holidays, this is a great way to protect your countertops and your tabletops because it's heat resistant. The other thing I like about it is it's non-slip. Yeah. So again, if you're using a cutting board, you know, when we were in culinary school, we used to have to put towels under sure. our cutting boards to yeah, make sure it wouldn't, them, move. wouldn't move. Right. Look at this. We'll just put a cutting board right on top of the mat yep. and it won't go anywhere. Or I'm any pressing project. down on this. I mean, this. even if you're doing a crafting project and you have tables and you're, you don't want things to slide around, you can utilize that underneath whatever it is that you're prepping. Um, let me show you the colors again because we have all these great colors. This is that beautiful big pink fuchsia color. I love the magenta, Right, yes. magenta we're calling that. This is the dark gray. It comes in this bright, bright gr uh, green, which is kind of almost truly a chartreuse if I was gonna I use it. I love that green. Uh, and then it comes in the lighter gray as well. You know what's so funny, Chris, is when I got this, I didn't expect to love it as much as I did <laughs> because I didn't know how strong it was going to be. And then when I saw it was super duper strong and it could rest over the sink without bending, I was completely sold on it. I'm like, this is great. And, and listen, I'm a guy, and you know from me, I have pretty much everything you would possibly want in a kitchen because I live, I love the kitchen. We love do love the kitchen. So I have everything. This I didn't have, and I was when it came, I was like, I don't have something like that. That is so neat, like this little this little uh, cooker we have coming up. Right? I don't have a pan that size. Well, and I love the fact that you can keep a couple of these and store them in a yeah. drawer, put them behind the sink faucet. They're just so Roll, easy. Bring it with you in your camp and use it at your campground. Exactly. It's a trivet, stuff like that. So simple. All right, if you love it, just pick a color. It's only twenty bucks. We'll send it home. You got thirty days to try it out. You're gonna love it. Stephanie Roberts is coming up, and man, I gotta tell you, I'm loving that a mini electric skillet. That'll be back right after this. Stick around. Love watching HSN? Then take us with you in the HSN app. Everything on your TV is streaming live on your phone. Anytime, any place, we're always with you. Download the iPhone or Android app today. We're getting ready to watch some clips of our absolute favorite co-host. Highlights of Colleen Lopez. We're celebrating her 25th anniversary. Check it out. This is the all-time best, Colleen losing control and that laugh that you can never, ever, ever forget. Oh. When Colleen laughs, I laugh. <laughs> she can do anything. No. Now I'm giving you love and you're shy? 25 years. Come join the fun as we celebrate the 25th anniversary of Colleen Lopez all month long. We understand every woman's skin is unique. We offer real beauty solutions for individual needs of real women, empowering women to achieve healthy, radiant-looking skin. Backed by over 30 years' experience, made from important ingredients combined with advanced science for affordable skin care that truly works. Change the story of your skin and your life forever. Genuine beauty begins with skin. Discover a world of beauty like you've never seen before. Beauty Report is the insider's guide to getting gorgeous. Join me tonight for a beautiful new routine. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900. I've been waiting for this since yesterday when I saw this item. I have been waiting yep. for Stephanie to come and show me. I can't wait to get off air and buy this. <laughs> I have never seen an electric, first of all, an electric 
for under $40 or $30. This is crazy at $22.95. And it's the perfect size. This is the launch of this. I don't think anybody has ever seen this on air before. I know you out there and you're going, finally, a perfectly sized electric skillet for me and my husband to be able to cook meals that we can eat. I don't need to cook for eight or 10 people every day. I cook for two people every day and sometimes four. One pot meals, true glide nonstick, adjustable temperature control, keep warm function so when the holidays come, you're gonna be saying, man, that guy and Stephanie, they hooked me up. This is the best way to keep my mashed potatoes warm, the stuffing warm, Swedish meatballs, hors d'oeuvres. I can't go on enough about it. Now, let me just check and see. I know we don't have a ton, ton, ton of these to go around. We don't. We brought in about 5,000. That may seem like a lot, but we'll probably go through a, a third of that just in this airing. If you want a real cooker, not a little toy, but a real cooker at the perfect size, Stephanie, you and I both love, we, we are both like, I'm impressed. You don't see this size. The size is amazing, and look at the sear on the steak. Wow. So don't think because it's small, don't think because it's electric and it's gonna sit on your counter that it can't do a great job. I've got gorgeous caramelization right here on my steak. I've added some mushroom, I've added some onion, I am gonna add some gravy, and I am gonna turn this down just a little bit and let it simmer. Let it simmer. Okay, and then we're gonna take a walk through what all we're getting with the dial. So we will come back to that. Look at how adorable that is. I, I'm in love with it. I mean, it's I just honestly, perfect. I have a dash that's about two and a half times the size of this. Sure, the 14. I only use it when my brothers and, and family come into town. I don't use it every day. Yep. Because it, it's just not worth the cleanup. Because it's big and you don't want to get it all out. So this is eight inches across and four inches deep. And it is the depth that has me so excited. Because with something like searing the steak, that's keeping all the spatters right where they should be. But I've also got enough depth that I've taken shrimp and sausage. I got a good little sear going there. Yeah. I put some peppers and onions in. There. The lid on now that I have added my pasta and a creamy Cajun sauce, by the way. That this is what's for dinner in my good. house. I could not be more excited and, and, about this. And that is perfect for two to four people. Exactly. Or a side dish for five people. I'd say a people. side dish four to six, a yeah. dinner two to four. Now, what is special about this is it's electric, so it's going to be right on my counter. I have the most awesome dial control here. When I am turned up to high, it's hot. It is 450 degrees. So you are getting a great sear on your steak. You can cook any meats on here with that kind of temperature without any problem. But so when now that I've got my food seared, I'm going to turn it down to a medium to a medium low, put the lid on, let that pasta cook in the liquid. I'll come back and put a little cheese in there and be gooey and wonderful. Now, right. why do I like this temperature control? Lift that lid and see Watch, what we've just you done. You're going you to love see the pizza. this. We did a pizza in here and you don't have to make your own dang pizza. The pizza's come in this size. Oh, we bought the but. refrigerator dough. Yeah. That was oh, so easy. Here it's sizzling here it? inside there. All right, let me get under here with this. Okay, so what we've done here is this is True Glide nonstick, and you are going to be able to see very easily here, no problem releasing dough. So refrigerator dough, let's look at the bottom. pushed it in. Yeah. We're going to take a let peek me show you the crust. and look yeah. at the bottom. Look <laughs> at that. I did this on my counter. I could not be more excited about this Perfect. because I don't want to heat up the oven to do a 10 inch pizza. You know, that's just not something I need to do. Oh my but gosh. what I do do want is to take my own dough, get that homemade feeling going there, top it with whatever I mm. want to top it with, and I'm good to go. Mandy, you know what I would do? I'm talking to I'm talking to Amanda off camera because she she's it. so smart and I always trust all her. You know what I do with this one? Get some of that cinnamon roll dough, right? Oh, I need yeah. the cinnamon roll dough in there. I maybe cook it for like 10, 15 minutes, then flip it, and then add the frosting on top and then put the lid on and say, what? Yeah. You having a little See, sweet craving this morning? My director, Mike, just said, yeah, now you're talking, buddy. Cinnamon rolls in there. But you know what? Otherwise, you'd have to... You'd have to heat up that whole oven. For this. For a cinnamon roll thing that's that big. This right. is the perfect size. Okay, if you love eggs... Hey, I gotta tell you, you wanna do like a frittata? You can't really... A frittata's a little challenging for people to do in a saute pan that don't know how to cook, right? It's a little tough on them, especially if you wanna flip it. A frittata is basically a no... A no 
mixed dish, right? It's no big deal. Just put, do it in there. Watch what she's going to do. Okay, watch my cool handles, by the way. We just finished cooking this. I can grab it and pick it up. All I do is remove about my this. electric cooker. Remember, true glide, non-stick. want some help? No. Got it? Got it. Look at that. What? Don't need any help with that. Uh -huh. That is a gorgeous frittata, and that is can good. Go in? Good to go. You may go in, and of course, it is good to eat. But look how easy to maneuver this is. This is going to surprise you. Not only does the frittata look amazing, but how how lightweight the actual pan is to work with. Could not be easier. So I like that for dexterity reasons. Yeah. I love that the handles are stay cool. I love that all I do is pull this out and oh I've even God. got fingers underneath it. It's well protected from any kind of heating so that I can work with it however mm. I need to. Let's talk about cleaning. You love it? I know, I'm going that's there good. too. I would have put about four more pounds of cheese in it, but that's just me. <laughs> I, mean, I would have put cheese on the bottom and then just... Oh, it it been could handle stuff. it, cheese yeah, on yeah, the yeah. bottom. Look at the nonstick. Look at the cleanup. We just wiped it right out. So Sweet. that's all you have to do is give it a quick rinse. You're not going to put it in the dishwasher because it does have the heating element, but it could not be easier to maneuver. Else? Yeah, put the quesadilla in I there. Just lay it in there? Yeah, just go ahead and slide oh, it on you. in. I got you. There you go. Boop, 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 boop. And that is how I'm going to get my crisp around the edge of the quesadilla. We'll turn that up. We'll crank, plug it back in. And remember, we're not going to turn it up too much. You've got some good heat here. So for something like crisping a quesadilla, I'm going to put my base you back do it in. Like medium low. Uh, yep, exactly. Now you do need to give this a good shove. Make sure it clicks, clicks in, in so yeah. the heating element is there and I like that too because that way you know it is secure in there. I'm going to turn it to medium low and crisp my tortilla. All right, we're going to take a quick little two second break here because I want to tell you the deal on this today, all right? I don't know how we're doing it at $22.95, but we are. It's normally going to be $28.95. I can't wait to get off air and get this because I could use this all year long. Danny just went to college, so I'm fighting yep. that. You know, a little empty nest. But I don't, and so I don't need a big giant pan, but I love, you all know I love to cook stuff, right? Can you think of a better mac and cheese pan than oh, this? Oh, that'd be amazing. Oh my you don't gosh. get crispy and crunchy on the edges. I love that. And you know what? You were talking about college. I dropped my daughter off for her first apartment. Yeah. Uh, we're out of the dorms now. This weekend, I'm going to send her one of these because whether you're cooking for yourself and your partner at home or whether it's kids cooking for each other, this is the best size because it's so easy to use. You're not turning on a gas or electric stove and worry about it getting too hot or yeah. worrying about it you know, not being the right temperature to ad adequately sear or steam your food. This is all happening right here in the pan. Look at what it did with those mussels. They opened up beautifully. We steamed them right here with the lid on, on a nice medium temperature. Remember, high, hot enough to steer. Medium gives me a good rolling hey, boil. Do you mind if I jump over Jump these? right ahead. I, all right. So we're doing Amanda, a shallow these, did fry. You do chicken? I don't know if it's chicken it's or chicken. fish. It's, it's chicken. chicken. So we so did a shallow fry of chicken. It. Medium temp, 350 degrees. Now, you know, because you're a kitchen person like me too, and obviously Amanda, who's, who's running the show here today behind the scenes, you know, you have to be a certain type of pan to be able to, to be able to actually Absolutely. fry. Absolutely. Well, and you have to hold an fry. even temperature. This yes. shows the quality of the heating element that Dash has put in this because we are able to hold that even temperature. Again, I don't want to do this on the stove. I don't want to deal with the mess. I've got a four inch depth here so it can handle doing the light shallow fry. Now I'm going to get my chicken crispy. Uh, you said fish. There's nothing better than a crispy fish stick. So oh much gosh. better when done in a shallow fry. So all I would do with these, and I want to show you really quick, and I'll stack two of them here. Okay. Right? Because I see you have, are these going on the chicken? Those are going on the arugula. Mind if I just give them a little slice? You do whatever you want to do. these are cooked perfect. Those are cooked perfect. Look at this, right? So if you want to do like Caesar salad and you don't have, and you're like, I mean, having like fried chicken on a Caesar salad would be so good. Look at how beautiful that is, right? That looks great. Yeah, but and it's the best perfect. way. Best way to get them crispy. You're not making a big mess. You're not getting out a deep fryer. Don't spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars on a deep fryer when really all you need is the four inch depth to submerge and do a little that fry. Was fun. I'm all about the full meals that we are able to do in the pan. So we just did pork chops. Again, look at this gorgeous sear. We were able to do the sear because high gets hot enough to caramelize for that. me. So we don't have to worry about getting out the pan, putting them on the grill. But then the liquids they released, 
Do you oh smell gosh. the fresh rosemary? Look we how pretty that is. added some apples. We added some shallots. I am all about the feelings and flavors of fall now, right around the corner. Oh yeah, I, I am. I am Jones to make like little pots of chili and things oh, like that. Oh, absolutely. Well, you could do things like that right in here because you can do your sear, you can do your simmer. And the thing about pork is, I hate doing it without any liquid added, like the apples, because it dries out. That is gorgeous. But I've got the sear. I don't want to miss out on the sear. So what Dash has done is they've given us this temperature control that gets hot enough to sear, yeah. low enough to simmer, and medium is the perfect boil in the middle. So we were able to do the fry. Let's keep going. All so right, now, watch this. Now, if you're on a diet, I will tell you, there are so many great opportunities out there at the grocery store for you to be able to eat well. And I will tell you, that riced cauliflower yep. is genius. I mean, that stuff is amazing. You brown it, I would challenge you in any dish that I make for you to not think that was rice. It, it really and is. Here's if you the toast deal. cauliflower, it tastes like a grain. And so, you don't have to buy it frozen because no. it gets mushy. Buy it yeah. fresh. This is already riced. I did not do the ricing. I bought it pre-bagged, ready to go. I'm going to put a quick saute on it. I am turned up to high. I added some veggies, add some sauce. I love it. A little teriyaki. Uh, and then basically, it'll taste just like fried rice. Exactly. You want to say hi to Sally? I would love to. Sa hey, where's Sally. Where's Sally from? Sally from Good Missouri. Morning. Welcome to HSN. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? Wonderful, Sally. Sally, do you own this little machine? Well, I do now. Oh, that girl. Good. Tell me why you bought it today. <laughs> I know why I love it. Why would you want to get this today? Well, I live alone, and it's really hard to make smaller portions right. in a big pan. Totally. And it looks... It looks wonderful. I can hardly wait to get it. You know, Sally, my mom lives with her husband, John, mm -hmm. and it's just the two of them. And I, yes. I get so tired of bringing them food, you know, that, that they mm -hmm. can't cook themselves. And they don't want a big, giant ordeal every time. Right, this is a one-pot right. pan, so if you, you could pretty much make... I mean, you, you guys, if you watch mm -hmm. me, you, uh, you know I can cook anything. I can cook probably mm -hmm. anything I love in that pan. Right. Yeah. Right. I think you'll love it because you won't have to turn on the oven. I'm pulling out shepherd's pie here. Whoa. I did it yeah. right on the countertop. It's so Ooh. nice not to Let heat up the Sally. oven. Sally, do you like right. shepherd? Do you like shepherd's it's pie? It's amazing. It's amazing. I've never seen one like this. <laughs> well, you are going to love it, my dear. Thank you for hanging on the uh -huh. line and talking to us. Thank you. All Enjoy. Right. See you, Sally. You know, I, the shepherd's pie, it's so funny. The shepherd's you, pie you, looks amazing. You didn't even ask me how much. You didn't even know, Amanda, when you did all that. You didn't know I, I love shepherd's pie. Oh, shepherd's pie. You can make hearty, like home type meals in here. Absolutely. And you know what I love? I love dessert and I love any dessert that is a fruit crumble. Again, rather than turning on the oven, I put my berries, I put my crumb topping right here in my dash skillet. Just because this is called an electric skillet, don't think you're limited to the oh pancakes, the French toast, the bacon. No, we are using this to bake. We are using this to sear. We have got guy on the shepherd's pie. We're using it to deep fry. We are That's sauteing cauliflower rice. Yeah. Look at the heat here. I've got enough temperature to sear. I've got a medium setting that is perfect for a boil. And then I've got a low setting for a simmer or even a bake. I've done a pizza crust. I've done things at every single temperature, yet it couldn't be simpler. You want to take a look at how yeah, things yeah, yeah. are going down I'll here? I'll start. I'll, you, you want to do the chicken and pasta and I'll do the steak? Okay. Well, look at what we did here. We put a great sear on some sausage and some shrimp. I added pasta with a little bit of a liquidy cream sauce. I watered it down to make sure I had enough liquid. Now I'm going to add in my Parmesan. Look at a one-dish meal cooked right on the countertop. This will easily feed three to four Blue people. Steak. Oh, that steak looks yeah. amazing. Again, yeah. that's a sear done on an electric skillet. It's nonstick, yet hot enough to give you that kind of gorgeous caramelization on your meat. Ooh, we made a mushroom and onion sauce with gravy to go along with it. And I love that it's all tabletop cooking. No open flames, no concerns about the stove, and nonstick, easy to wipe out right, and clean. Hold on. I gotta put some gravy Look on there. Look at that gravy. Oh. Looks wonderful. Where's the green? All right, colors come in black, red, or navy. This is a fun thing to add. Man, do I have to leave or can I eat all this? <laughs> oh, I, I have, have to, to go keep because cooking. now we're going to take our leftovers. We're going we're to give them extra life because we're going to use food saver. Can I go now? Perfect. All right, great job, Stephanie. Good to see that you. was fun. Thanks, Sally, for calling in. All right, let's wander over here. 
My girl Rochelle is Hello. here. Hi, Rochelle. How are you today? Hi. Let me tell you, food saver. I bought my first food saver so many years ago, I can't even remember. It was mm -hmm. probably like 20 years ago. Food saver's been around for over 30 years. And you remember the machines, that great machines. You know, you could spend over 100, maybe $200 on the original food savers, and they were wonderful. Well, what food saver did is they said, we need a model for people at home that they can use on all their stored goods, on their leftovers, on their cheeses, on their produce, so that they can buy in bulk and save leftovers and save money. This is $39. It is totally convenient and money saving. It is the ultimate food storage solution. And all you do is you hit a button, suck out the air, extend the shelf life of whatever you put in there. When you order today, because the, the offer is amazing, you get the food saver machine, and this is basically a vacuuming machine, sucks the air out. Remember, air is the friend of our food to ripen it. It's the enemy of our food when it starts to spoil. So you want to remove the air because your food's already ripe. It doesn't need to have any more ripening, and it's already cooked. So you want to take the air out if you want to freeze it or put it in the fridge. Basically, the food saver, you get two of the containers, okay? And these are amazing. This is that amazing Triton material. You'll have this the rest of your life. This will live longer probably than you will. This is Triton, it's amazing. Two sizes, you're gonna get a uh, two quart, or one, excuse me, you're gonna get, what am I gonna get? Three cup and a five cup. Ugh. The quart containers are the bags. So you get a whole bunch of bags to go along with it, remove the air, prolong the shelf life. This whole system is $39.99. You'll probably pay for itself in the first month of not throwing away food. All right, I got it all out. I'm sorry. I know you I did talked. A great job. I know, you but I want, I want Rochelle to show you because the, the demos are amazing on this. We have about 11 minutes. I'm just going to let you go. Sure, sure. Yeah. So let me show you how easy it is to use. We like to call this the Tower of Power. It's a vertical design, so it can live on your countertop. It easily slides under your kitchen counters. You're just going to lower the vacuum seal to the little bullseye here. There's a little circle. And I'm going to show you how easy this is to use and how powerful it is. So as soon as that's lowered to the bullseye, automatically a green light's come up, on, you know, illuminating here on top. So all I have to do is press the button and it's going to suck all of the air out of this bag. It's going to crush the aluminum can. And the reason this is good for your food is because air really is the enemy wow. of food. Look at it go. It's so powerful and that it's crushing this aluminum can. And it also knows when to stop. So I'm going to let it run. And once it's sucked all, when it, once it's sucked all, all the air the out of there, it's going to stop on its own. But you can also control it. So if you're doing something more delicate like breads or muffins, um, you can also pr press the button again and have it stop. Stop. But look how it crushed Completely. this aluminum can. And that's a metal can. That gives you an idea of the power of the suction on this thing. It, it, it really is powerful. So what does that mean for you? So whenever you, have you ever gone grocery shopping and then you clear out your refrigerator and you throw away a bunch of things and you're like, oh, all this I stuff I just did it bad. like the day before yesterday. <laughs> I had so many, you know what I threw away? What did you throw away? Half a tray of blueberries. Oh no. Well, Half see, a tray of blueberries. blueberries here. And then they come on BOGO sometimes when you want to save yeah. some money and buy double the blueberries. And, blue, and I feel like blueberries and strawberries go bad as soon as you look at them. All you have to do is put them in your fresh saver, suck out the air. It's gonna last two to five times longer than it would if you just kept it in the container. But also think about things like cheese. So when you get your cheese at the supermarket and you look at the expiration date, the expiration date on here is December. So why can this last until December? Because it's vacuum sealed. So you're yes. gonna get that vacuum sealing power at home with all of your food. So you can buy in bulk, you could cut this cheese in half and use half of it and save half of it for later. But because the bags are reusable, you can also cut what you need, open it up, and then reseal it. So I'll show you really quickly here with the cheese. So let's say I just want to cut a little slice of cheese. All I have to do is seal this back up and then we can reseal the bag and use them over it. and over and use over them again. Over and yep. over again. So you can wash and reuse them. They are dishwasher safe. They're a really heavy, thick ply too. So I use this for my deli meats all the time. And just like that, we're going to reseal the bag and reuse it. So I love that done. it has done. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I love that it's something that you can use and, you know, over and over again I and cut what you that need. Demonstration enough. I just love that. Well, because you're getting an industrial type seal and that's why companies do it because they want the food to last in, from the time it gets from point A to point B. And which cheese looks better, really? I mean, you want to keep your cheese nice and fresh yeah. and not kind of melted and gooey and, and wrapped in plastic wrap like we normally do. You know what I did just did last night, too, is my husband and I wanted some dessert, so we had one of those frozen desserts that you keep in the freezer. It was a key lime pie, mm -hmm. but we each just wanted to slice. I put the key lime pie, the, the rest of the pie anyway, <laughs> in my gallon size bag. So really, you can use it over and over right. again. You are getting the um, I love three the, cup and the two cup yeah. as well. But think about your football games. Think about your tailgates happening this fall when you're loading up your uh, cooler with all of your things for your burgers and for your hot dogs. 
you know, when, whenever you use just a regular plastic baggie, water can seep in there, you get soggy sandwiches. This vacuum seal is gonna keep it airtight, so you can put all of these things in the cooler, nothing's gonna get wet, nothing's gonna spill out, plus it's gonna remain fresh. Yeah, hey, by the way, if you're wondering how much money you can save, well, let's give you an idea. If you're like an average family of four people, we have a little chart you can look at. This is how much you can expect to save, your estimated savings. And is that a, I, I can't read from here because of my glasses. How long is that? Is that in a year? That's in a year. So with a week, you would typically save about $61 wow. if you're buying in bulk. And then over a, a month's time, you'll save about $260. Wow. And then... Look at the year savings. The year savings is about $3,000. So that's, you know, the price of a used car. That's a nice vacation. What? And so that's the amount of money that you'll save it's, by not throwing your food and, away and, at yeah, the end of the week. <laughs> every one of you out there who's watching me, I'm talking to you, you know that you have probably f thrown food away in the past week, maybe yes. two, right? You threw something away that you were like, oh, that's a dollar and a half that I didn't get. Like the, the blueberries I lost, that's two dollars I threw away. Couldn't eat them, I mean, you can't eat rotten blueberries, right? I guess you could mix them in a shake or something, but I didn't do that. So if you wanna save money, do you ever have, do you ever buy hot dogs? Hot dogs don't come in a two pack or a four pack, do they? They come in a 10 pack or an eight pack. What do you do with the other hot dogs? You try to wrap them in plastic, put them in there, and the next time, what do you do? You throw them away because you bought fresh hot dogs. It happens to every one of us. What about rolls? When you buy hot dog rolls, you, the hot dog rolls aren't sold in a four pack. One day, somebody will be smart and they'll sell hot dog <laughs> rolls in a four pack. I'm talking to you, Pillsbury, whoever that is, <laughs> Pepperidge Farm. You need to do that, but in the meantime, this is the way that you save money. It is, it's not even a question of, it's how much you will save. Can we show the uh, air yeah. coming out of the containers? Let's show the air coming out of the container. So this is lettuce. I don't know about you, but I feel also like the lettuce always rots in the back of the refrigerator. So this is lettuce that we've just kept in the yeah. container. Usually Useless. you'll just fold it over, it gets soggy, it starts to sink. This is lettuce that we've kept fresh in the five uh, cup container. There is this little tray that goes in the bottom to keep at the bottom to keep it from getting into the water. So it's wonderful. And then here, I'm gonna hold this up to my microphone so you can hear the air coming out of it. That is all the air going back in. So that's the sound of freshness. So if you want to see what this looks like, I actually have marshmallows here. And you know, this is great for a marinade. I thought about you with this because you yeah, like yeah, to grill yeah, and do your, do your oh, meats. Yeah. So this is going to save you time with your marinade. So I want you to watch the marshmallows here because I can't show you meat marinating. I'm going to show you these marshmallows expanding. So you can hear the machine working. You can hear it sucking out all the air. You can also see the marshmallows start to get bigger. They're expanding as the air is being removed. So what that means for your meats and your marinades is for your meats, it's going to pull apart the meat fibers and let all of that uh, marinade get into all the meat See, fibers. Look how big they got. They got really huge. And yeah. so you can do your marinades in 15 minutes instead of six hours. So now make sure we get the close up before we take the air oh, out. Oh sure, here, I'll put it here, right here so you can okay. hear it. Cause I want you to see it uh, go down. I also want you to hear it. Here's my microphone. Mm -hmm. Why? Is that fun? <laughs> it's ask Mr. Science why, because marshmallows are full of air and they're under the pressure of the earth. So when you remove the pressure by taking the air out, they get bigger. That's your, that's your last science lesson for and this today. Is... But if you're doing meat, like if you yeah. want to put a piece, like a filet mignon in there, and a filet mignon, uh, and I know this from restaurants and but any, whatever, you know, everybody say, oh, filet is so delicious. A filet mignon does not have a lot of fat in it, so it's not really one of the more flavorful cuts, but it is very tender. So you would put a filet in there with maybe a little, uh, I would use like zesty Italian dressing or teriyaki that sauce. That sounds delicious, a teriyaki sauce oh. for sure. We've got some here. We also have our chicken marinating. So yeah. you're gonna reduce your cooking time too. Like, let's say you forgot to marinate it before you went to work and you get home and you're like, oh, I really wanna marinate my meats. You can do it in 15 minutes with your fresh saver. But I also wanted to show you how easy it is to use, you don't have to worry about lining it up because it fits in the bottom here like a puzzle piece. So there's a little square yeah. at the bottom here and there's a little square right here. Easy. And they line up super easy. Same with the bags, there's a little round circle and all you have to do is line it up with the bullseye. And so yeah. you put the little bullseye there and you line it up and it'll automatically Sucks suck out all the air. air out. Yes. Let me show you what you're gonna get again. And then Rochelle, if you wanna step over behind me, sure. I, I want you to show that guacamole because I know. guacamole, <laughs> I, don't, I don't care, there's nobody out there. I mean, maybe you've got the secret, oh, I keep the pit and the guacamole that way it keeps it from turning that disgusting charcoal gray color that guacamole turns. Mm -hmm. We're gonna show you how you can preserve that. The bags are all included. These are reusable bags. You're gonna use these over and over. Two size containers with the tray, all included, easy directions, and of course, the uh, food saver itself. Normally, you go out and you buy a food saver, and if you, if you buy their top end models, they're two, 300 bucks. Um, this is only $39.99, and what it does, it keeps your food fresher, 
longer because we're removing the air and air is what basically makes your food spoil. Look at this avocado. Look at the These avocados. Are same avocado. <laughs> same right? avocado. We cut it this morning and made the guacamole this morning too. I feel like all I have to do is look at an a avocado when it starts to go bad. So we cut this avocado this morning. We were able to save this half in our fresh saver. So no air is getting to that. So it's staying nice and green. So this is going to last you longer. You can use it the next day. You can use it two or three days from now. But look at the guacamole too. So we made this guacamole this morning. Morning. And this is what air does to your food. Not very appetizing, it's not right? That's that's cockamole. <laughs> that's is. what that is. It is. And usually yeah, this is that. what you do. You know, you just put, uh, you know, a little lemon on it and put the, you know, the uh, plastic wrap yeah. and it doesn't really work. No. But we also put the guacamole in our fresh saver pack and look at how green it is. You can see that the air has been removed because the little dimple here is indented. So you know that it's fresh. Right. You know that there's no air in there. And look at how green that has remained compared to this guacamole. Uh, both made at the same time, just stored differently. You know what I love it for too? Coffee. Things that, things that, that go stale really quickly. Coffee, uh, you know, any of your spices, because when they're exposed to air, that's that's why you smell them and they mm -hmm. smell so good. That starts to fade after a while. So coffee, things that, that bugs get to, like um, in uh, you know, like sugar or uh, any grains, right, that the bugs eat. You can keep those perfectly sealed. Just like a lot of them, just like they came in the store, right? You can yeah. do this with chips, anything. Just don't take all the air out. Take most of the air out. It gives you more space. Here's where we were talking about those fillets, right? Mm -hmm. Gives you more space and it keeps things fresh. Again, you know, they do make packs of bacon that are a little bit smaller for us out there, but they're expensive. So buy your bacon in the regular pack and what you don't use, use the food saver for. For sure. I love to use mine for deli meats because I feel like deli meat, when you get it fresh sliced and you get it home, just a couple days later, it starts to get that little slime. It's not very appetizing. And so when I get home, I always put my deli meats in my fresh saver. I love that it's on my countertop so I can just use it and reuse it again. I take out the meat that I want for the making the sandwiches and I reseal the package. I want you the to coffee. do coffee. I can, oh, it smells so good. Can Since you do you the coffee? It, I can do, do the, the coffee. Can. Let's do Let's coffee. Let's do coffee. So I want to show you. Buy coffee and you go ahead, you Michelle. Seal and you got leftovers, right? So you put your seal beans it. or your fresh ground. If you buy it in bulk, we like to get the three pound bags um, at the big box store. So all I did was seal this up. I'm going to line up the little circle here, here we go. with the bullseye. And then all I have to do is lower this Watch to the, the bottom. Bag. Watch and then that. there it goes. It's going to suck all of the air out. It's going to keep the coffee nice and fresh. You're going to awesome. have that same wonderful flavor every time you open the bag. And because it's reusable, because it's resealable, Love you it. can use this over and over again. All right, Rochelle, great job as always. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey, stick around. I know the lovely Valerie is coming up with Skin Cosmetics. See you soon. Oh, the coffee smells so good. <laughs> Thank you. Skin's philosophy is that products have to work. Great skincare begins with a consistent skin.